Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. This is Aishram Malyala. In this particular video, I am going to give you all the details related to IIIT Hyderabad. Admission process, cutoffs, placement stats, campus life and infrastructure, fee structure, faculty, all these related to all these things. I am going to talk in this particular video. Previously, I also made a podcast with one of my friends, Sai Vinish, who is also a student at IIIT Hyderabad, joined through UGWE. He explained in each and everything about IIIT Hyderabad and UGWE in his own words. So you can just watch that video so that you can also understand through his words. So I will be leaving that link in the description as well as in the ITAPs. Without taking much time, let's get into today's video. I am going to give away UGWE preparation books. So these are the books I'm, which I am going to give away. If you want to be part of this particular giveaway, watch the video till the end without skipping. So IIIT Hyderabad, well known for advanced technical and research training, comparable with top IITs, first college where Apple have visited for campus placements. So these are some quick facts of uh, IIIT Hyderabad. So if I talk about placement starts of last two years, these are the placement starts of last two years. You can just see this outstanding placement stats, 100% placed throughout last two years. So you can see CSC highest package is 14 and LPA. Uh, this is a four year BTEC course and average LPA is 25 and 13 is the lowest. For some colleges, 13 is the highest. So this college 13 is the lowest. And ECE highest package is 43 and average is 20 and uh, lowest LPA is 6 LPA. 100%, 100%, 100%, 100%, 100%, 100% placements in Triple IIT Hyderabad. And if I talk about five year dual degree courses, 85 lakhs per annum. That is really huge, right? Last year's. Before last year's, these are the package. Just pause the video and just check out that placement stats. So that speaks a lot about Tripleite Hyderabad. An academy prodigy, chance to win 20 lakh college grant, 13 February 10 a.m. onwards from class 7th to 12th. So in this exam, you are going to uh, test your knowledge as well as if you get good rank, you are going to uh, remove the burden on your parents as you are going to get 20 lakh college grant from an academy. It's an all India level test series. You can win scholarships and rewards. Enroll now freely using the link in the description and my code CharanYT. These are the rank rewards and scholarships based on your rank you are going to get in this particular prodigy exam. Subscription offer valid on Plus and Iconic both from 7th to 9th February. So if you take 3 months JE, 1 month JE extension, 6 months JE, 1 month JE extension and 2 months CBSE extension. So try to take the subscription in this offer period so that you will get a lot of benefits. Use the link in the description and share YT for 10% instant discount. So UL8 ID JE test series plus test analysis class. Practice section. Full coverage of tests as per latest IDJE pattern curated by top educators. Access to 30,000 plus practice questions. You can just see the prices according to 3 months, 6 months and 18 months. And for IDJE 2022, 23 full syllabus tests which are 8 mains and 15 advanced. From 6th February 2022 to 24th July 2022. You can enroll now using the link in the description and my code CharanYT. Day PP is for JE mains and advanced uh, curated by top faculties for IDJE. Uh, compete with learners on daily basis, match your score with topper to check your preparation. Monday to Thursday, 7 pm from 7th February, 30 minutes, 30 questions, physics and chemistry and maths, 10 questions each. Every week, 10 enrolled lucky winners will get surprise gifts from an academy. Enroll now using the link in the description. The X factor of Triple IIIT Hyderabad is their faculty. The faculty, majority of the PhD holders, almost 90 to 95 percent of them holds PhD. No faculty is recruited just with graduation. Majority faculty have the experience more than 10 years. Fee structure. Fee structure is bit high in IIIT Hyderabad. 3 lakhs per year tuition fee and 6500 per month mess and hostel fees. If you do BTEC, which is 4 year course, CSA and EC, 12 lakhs for 4 years and if you do dual degree, it is 15 lakhs for 5 years. So if you are in the merit list, in the 5th year, you may also get a tuition fee support from the research advisor, research center or institute for all the meritorious students in your fifth year. Talking about financial assistance, be it loans and scholarships, I will be talking in this particular video. If you talk about loans, SBI, IIIT Hyderabad branch okay, will issue a loan up to 20 lakhs without any need of any security. So all the students can avail this particular of, uh, opportunity from SBI. You can just, if you want to take loan, you can take the loan easily. Uh, or else, if you want the scholarship, your family income should be less than 8 lakhs per annum. And for all the students, it is like pay it forward basis. What is meant by pay it forward? So now if you are availing this scholarship from the Triple IIIT Hyderabad alumni, when you become the alumni, when you got settled in your career and when you are earning, at that time you should also pay the fees of one more student at that particular time. So that is what pay it forward. And now comes to what are all the programs offered by Triple IIIT Hyderabad. BTEC in CSE, BTEC in ECE. So for all these 3, 4, 5, 6, these are dual degrees. For 4 year courses, these two are only BTEC courses. 
So through JE score you can enter this regarding this I will be talking as you move forward in this video. So these are the modes of undergraduate admissions. So UGE and uh, SPEC special channel for of admission, lateral entry ex entrance exam and Olympiad or KVPY direct admission for students abroad and JE mains for single degree programs. So for this, this is for single degree and dual degree and uh, SPEC is only for single degree and lateral LEEE is for dual degree and Olympiad is also for dual degree. So that's the students, those who are foreign abroad students with SAT score and all, that process will be different. You can just uh, check out the official website regarding that. So now comes to UGW. What is exactly UGW is undergraduate entrance examination for Triple ID Hyderabad for five year dual degree programs only. So two step process exam for three hours interview for shortlisted students through exam. So you will be having exam those who get good score. So there will be some cutoffs and all so that will keeps on changing year to year. So all those students who got shortlisted will be having an interview uh, by Triple ID Hyderabad uh, members admission members panel members. They will take the interview and based on the performance in the interview, they will give you the admission. It's a two section computer based exam. You need to write an online. So one first section is SUPR subject proficiency test, which is for one hour and REAP re, uh, re, we usually REAP research aptitude test for two hours. So continuously for three hours. It's not like paper one and paper two like advanced. It will be for continuously three hours. One hour and two hours continuously. First, should be, first, you have, everyone should give in the first one hour. Everyone should give SUPR in the second. I mean, the next section, which is for two hours, everyone should give REAP. Automatically, the paper shifts. Without that, you can't give one and a half hour for SUPR. It's not like that. Within one hour, you need to complete SUPR. Uh, so now I will talk about SUPR subject proficiency test. Syllabus will be PCM, Physics, Chemistry, Math, same as JEE means. Number of questions 50. Marking scheme plus one for correct answer and no negative marking in first of one hour. Total marks is 50. So according to some questions, uh, some students 40 to 50, 40 out of 50 questions will be asked from maths and physics. So that's really huge. Now comes to REAP research aptitude test. Number of questions will be 50 plus two for correct answer and minus one by four for every uh, wrong answer. Total marks is 100. So you can just see weightage in REAP. You will be asking like arithmetic, algebra and geometry and re reasoning and data interpretations. So this is how the number of questions asked year by year 2018 to 2021 the stats are here this particular stats also I have uh, taken from that books which I which I am going to uh, give away in this particular video so stay tuned for that. So now comes to any preparation material so how to prepare for these exams SUPR and REAP. So yes you can use the books by triple IT prep in order to prepare real for UGWE you need some sort of material right there are a lot of material which are available for GE. But as far as my knowledge, there are very little options you have, very, 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 very little options you have for UGWE. So as far as I know, one will be the online, some, some kind of websites and other will be this particular books by Triple ID Prep. For example, if I talk about this particular book by Triple ID Prep, REAP UGWE. So they have given the previous four year analysis to graphs. You can just see these graphs. So subject wise weightage, arithmetic and basic PCM, algebra and geometry, REAP reasoning and data interpretation through graphs, each and everything which will help you to analyze how the paper is going to be and there are these many questions to solve. You can solve all these questions, practice problems. So which will really help you. Uh, so these books are 100% reliable for your UGWE preparation and these books are prepared so according to the latest pattern of UGWE exam so based on previous analysis how the questions were asked so according to that the question books are prepared I will leave the links in the description for that particular uh, books you can just buy from there and now comes to giveaway alert check a google form in the description solve the questions in it I will be giving two to three questions in there so you have to solve that and upload your answers share the video in your college groups take that screenshot and also upload that First 15 members who do this process will get one out of the three free UGWE preparation books. So these are the three books you can use guys. So this book is UGWE REAP research aptitude test and uh, this book is SUPR subject proficiency test and this is memory based previous year papers of for triple eight Hyderabad UGWE. So if you want any one of this book freely just follow the process open google form solve the questions send the answers and also share this video to your college group take the screenshot upload that and first 15 members will get the books one one book each of their choice from these three books 
So winners names will be announced on my Instagram. I will be leaving my Instagram profile link in the description. Follow me there. I will be announcing the winners there. And now comes to dual degree seat matrix. How many seats are available for this particular dual degree? For CSD, ECD, CND, CSD, CLD, 30, 25, 15, 15, 12, 97 seats. There is no category. So here in this particular dual degree courses, there is no reservation. So these are the number of seats. And next comes to JEE. This is only for four year programs only. It's a two step process. You have to write JEE exam and JEE mains mainly and get a good score. So after getting a good score, you need to apply for this particular JEE mains admission process. This particular triple eight Hyderabad is not available on JOSA. What you have to do is there is one separate application for this process. So when it released, I will inform my on my channel for that. You need to subscribe uh, my channel and uh, just click on the bell icon so whenever I upload a video you will get a notification so there will be separate admission process you need to apply when this particular uh, process opens on admission portal of AAAT Hyderabad you need to upload your score so how much percentile you got how much rank you got then after that so they will they will be giving the I mean they will have the merit basis set right? based on that you will be getting the seat so that's what the process is and if I talk about previous uh, cutoffs and all so for admissions of uh, four year courses, these are the seat matrix. G gender neutral will have 75 seats and female only will have 25 seats. Here only gender and female neutral according to JEMS, but no categories like OBC, general, these things will not be there, EWS and all. For ECE, 15, 45 seats for gender neutral and 15 seats for female only. If you want to see, get into CSE, if you at least get 99.9256414, rank 936. If you want to get into ECE, you should at least have 99. 72 percentile so these things my friend also said in that particular podcast video check out that video link in the description also in the items so now comes through this pro process called kvpy if you want to get into triple eight hyderabad through this particular process so those students who have the kvpy rank kishore vaignanik prayojana yojana it's a kind of olympiad usually students give after their 12th in their 12th or after their 12th so if those students who have below 5000 or or equal to or below 5000 rank can apply for this particular uh, pro mode of admission and top 100 will be shortlisted for the interview and only eligible for CND program so BTEC in computer science and MS by research in natural sciences for that particular program dual degree program these students are eligible one more mode of admission is called SPEC SPEC it's a special channel for students who are qualified for Udan scheme of CBSE and studies at uh, Jawahar Navodaya Vidyalaya at least for two last two years 11th and 12th so 12th should passing and belong to any one of the below, below categories so these students are required to give only SUPR they need not to give REAP then followed by an interview 10 each seats for four years CSE and EC courses for this particular mode of admission they offer four year courses and now comes to infrastructure so if I talk about infrastructure it's a 66 acre campus in Gachiboli Hyderabad Within campus facilities include a bank extension counter, two ATMs, stationery shop, gym and laundry services, library and digital library, well equipped and air conditioned labs, high performance computing facility to meet the research demands and good sports facilities and three veg mess and one non veg mess are available inside the campus. Every student need to uh, have a room in the campus itself so they can also stay back but it's kind of uh, rule that every student should stay back in the campus each student will get their separate room so that uh, they can uh, give uh, their 100% efforts developing skills and learning knowledge so that's what uh, the thing, uh, thing about hostels in AAAT Hyderabad so if many people may think that there is a misconception that in AAAT Hyderabad doesn't have a good campus life but it's not it's not right so you are going to have a very good campus life like many other IITs and like many other NITs and like many other Taiwan colleges so don't worry about that particular campus life if you want to know the proof just watch the podcast which i had made with my friend sai i will be leaving that podcast link in the description as well as in the tabs and you can just see some pictures of triple eight hyderabad so this is of labs and some academic buildings hostels and all and this is like seminar halls sports this is also sports and library digital library and library you also be part of this particular giveaway so just uh, open the google form in the description and uh, solve those questions take a screenshot of the uh, group where you have shared this particular video link and uh, upload that and be a part of this giveaway so you will be getting so any one of these three books of your choice freely for your UGWE preparation 
so that's it for this video guys if you find this is a time worthy video please do like share and subscribe see you in the next one until then take care bye bye jai hind